My man Ise is going through it, bro. This is like the third time that Asha just got taken away and we can't do anything about it. Like, every time he does something, he just takes an L. I thought that our main character is supposed to be some Giga Chat super main character, but it's still only episode 5. And the whole thing with the boost toe, right? The whole thing with twice critical. Is it really just doubling your power or is there something more to it? Because usually a character like this is going to have an OP power. You must specifically set, you know, that sacred gear, you got to be very careful of it. But then she perhaps inaccurately, you know, said that this is just twice critical. When in fact, this could be like exponential critical. We don't really know if this really ends at two times or if we can have multiple multipliers, right? So two outcomes. Either Issei has to just grow his base strength so strong that if when twice critical does happen, you know, we can obviously scale up so instead of like two times two maybe be three times two right or we just say fuck it it's not twice critical you can boost him multiple times the more hornier he gets the stronger he gets i believe that a show like this is gonna have some crazy power like that where he just keeps saying boost him, keeps getting hornier more multipliers more multipliers that's how i'm expecting how this shit to go down we're at the pretty hype part with um i think yuma's about to extract you know asha's sacred gear let's begin today's reaction conquer Love? Love? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Dude, that Yuma ass shot is always the best, man. Supreme Fallen Angel. It's like tears? But can Ise really fight Yuma in this current state where she's a Supreme Angel? Konika's still wearing green because obviously it's still the same day. Yeah, Kiba and Konika will take care of the fodder. Now you go up there, but like, can you do this? Can we just like put the secret gear back into Ashi? How does that work? Huh? <laughs> the way that the nipple fell down. <laughs> There's just one single nipple. <laughs> I shouldn't be laughing in this like, dramatic scene, but come on, bro. Okay, she's not dead. I thought people die when you extract the sacred gear. Oh my god, that at the Yuma ass shots, man. Thank you, cameraman. Thank you, cameraman. Bro, look at the different pattern in the left cheek and the right cheek. <laughs> not really. <laughs> we got play so hard. <laughs> Fuck you, Yuma. How could you do this to me? <laughs> What are you saying, man? He's too kind. Yeah! He's such a nice person! How could you do this? To the streets, guys. To the fucking streets. If she breathes, she's a... Finish the sentence. No, don't worry. We can do that with Ashia now, man. Nothing could have gone wrong except you killing him at the end. Damn, bro. She's getting, like, personal right now. Like, you're too vanilla for me. Shut up. Oh, God. She's just teething. Bro, she is just so PM right now. Holy fuck. No, it was not a boring date. It was a very cute and nice date. We got her ratchet. I can't believe she's even changing her fucking voice acting to make fun of us, man. All right. Issei, come on. Oh, okay, we just kind of move fast, but, you know, like, we need to get more than just twice critical, bro. <laughs> if they're back, I'm sure they're not going to die, but still, this is some death flag shit, bro. Wow, Koneko actually smiled there. Maybe? Is this actually the real shit? Yeah, and like, what about our original Rachu? Is it fine? Bro, cover her left titty up. Pull the shirt up. I think those friends are kind of shitty, to be honest, but whatever. I don't think I should, should have friends like that. I think they'd be fucking upset that you have a girlfriend, bro. Oh, my God. No, nah, no shot. She's dying here, dude. She might close her eyes for a bit, but we gotta get the sacred gear back. Oh, look. She's such a kind person, dude. And you was actually such a fucking demon. There is no way she's dead here. Uh-uh. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Uh-uh. Bro, cover her titty up at least. In this fucking moment. You're gonna just show some respect. Nah, she's not dead. Can't be. Uh-uh. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Fucking get back in there. Say boost to. Beat her ass. 
Get the sacred gear back. No one's gonna save you though, bro. You need to make your own dreams a reality. No one will help you like that. Yuma. God, you're so petty. It's, it's so me. It's so personal. Like, come on. We got the barriers though, right? All right, triple prompt attack, whatever. Oh, with just her aura alone. Thank you, cameraman. Ria's panty shot. I want Ria's to pop off, man. I don't really know what her power is, but it just looks like black, like red fire. Divine protection? That seems kind of important to the plot. Azazel Shimahaza. Really important characters for the future. Oh god, Yuma ass shot again. Oh god, cameraman, you, you know exactly how I like Yuma, oh my god. You know, as much of a villain Yuma is, her design is insane. Oh, another ass shot incoming. Please cover her fucking left titty, bro. Just like, put, put the shirt back on. Come on. I want some main character bullshit plot armor. Come on. That's right. Just get upset. The more of an emotional response, the stronger it will be. Okay, boost toe again. You was kind of tripping there. Wait, wait, she's scared. But I thought twice critical is pretty weak. Yeah, but what if it's not just twice? Ah, come on. Ugh, ugh. It's already over, bro. Oh, hello, Ash. Uh oh, transition scene incoming. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh god! Uh, it's actually this one's actually pretty tame compared to the previous ones. How do we? If, if his legs are just done like that, I mean. Oh, thank you, cameraman again. Can he ignore the pain and keep running like a main character? Like, is that the plot armor? Another boost tool. Wait, that's another boost tool though. But like. No, it can't be his limit. There's got to be more to it. There is no Lord. There is no God. You got to do it yourself. A demon Lord. Wait. Wait. Is there some kind of like Satan? Like the devil? Like, but we are devils. But wait, what? Just give me the power to protect my friends. Come on. How's he getting up? Oh, okay, wings are out. Okay, but still. Why is he standing? Maybe it's some cra crazy adrenaline? He's just powering through the pain, right? Damn, but this is a main character moment. You know, I thought the hornier he got. Wait! Explosion? Huh? Wait, how strong is it? How strong is it? No, it's not just twice critical. It's gotta be like multiple critical, right? Oh, she's actually getting so terrified, bro. If we punch her now and land a hit, like, uh, what's gonna happen? Eat shit. Punch her in the titty. I couldn't really tell when he punched her. I'm not really sure what's going on, though. Explosion, you know, the... The dragon claw seemed to have evolved the angrier he got. I thought it'd be like the hornier you are, the more stronger you get, but okay. Oh, Rias. Are you sure? Were you watching this entire time? Were you all just watching this entire time? Wait, is, is Yuma done? Like that one punch is done? I mean, she seemed to be alive. Uh, oh, Koneko. <laughs> get back here. Koneko really just... <laughs> Fest her back? What's she gonna do? Is she gonna do a checkmate? Mm. Oh shit, the three servants or something, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's Akino? We didn't even get to snow. We got to see Ria's like power up, but then we didn't really see anything. Princess of Destruction. Cool nickname. <laughs> Akino's literally cleaning. 
digging up after their fucking, like, not dead body, but their feathers? That is cold. Uh, sure, maybe, kind of. Hey, you're dodging the question. But yeah, did it, it evolve, right? The shape changed. It's not twice critical. What is it? Multiple critical? Every 10 seconds? Wait, wait, wait. Surpass a Satan or God? One of the 13? What, what? One of the 13? What? Emperor of Boosted Gear. There's just so much shit coming down. One of the 13 powers that can rival God or Satan. Satan clearly does exist. So it takes time to power. So like, we gotta charge up, right? We gotta literally just like, have prep time. Oh. Asha or... Nah, nah, punch her right now. Nah, you think you can fucking change back? Nah, uh-uh. Uh-uh. Boost all that bitch in the face. I don't remember it, to be honest. I, I don't remember. Fuck her, dude! Remember what she did to Rachu! Yes, it's like, bro, come on. He say, bro, punch her in the face. Fucking smack her with a dragon gauntlet. End her. Checkmate. <laughs> Only I can seduce him. I'm not sure about the mechanic at the end. You know, of how she like, not exercises, but gets rid of like a fallen angel at the end. Or even the devil, the straight devil, right? I don't really know what she does there at the end, other than call checkmate. Like, can that be done anytime? Huh? Bishop, right? She's gotta be the bishop. It makes sense thematically. Yep. And I've been saying, like, who's the bishop role, right? We didn't have one. Makes sense to be Asha. Still don't really know how these chess pieces can just do that, but... She can just resurrect people like this and just give them a chess piece and, you know, they're back. Aww. And please, retrieve the Rachu. I'm pretty sure Yuma, like, blew it up. Oh, new new alarm clock. Oh, what are you going to do if I don't wake up? Oh, where's my hand going? <laughs> I love that alarm clock, bro. Yeah, and we're done. We don't have enough. Yeah, well, is there going to be more pawns? How does that work? There's a lot of pawns, so his abilities were that, that crazy? Instead of a singular position, all eight was into one? Oh, that's actually kind of hype, right? Thank you, cameraman. There's no need to do that, but sure. <laughs> Whenever they do exposition, you usually just cut to fan service. One of the 13 longiness. All 13 gear has boosted? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Are you the ruined princess and he's the dragon? I don't know what those references are, but okay. Is she watching? Oh, I'm just crying! Yeah. No, actually, it's not like that. Actually, it is like that. No, actually, like, I can no more, though. Oh, no. No, no more god. You're, you're what the devil's now. <laughs> she can't pray to the god anymore, bro. She's the devil. Oh, a cake? Damn, what a happy ending to this arc. Oh? The fuck? Wait, who is this? Dio's voice actor. Dio's voice actor. Wait, who are these dudes? Wait, wait, wait! Are these the new angels that Yuma was talking about? Whoa. So much plot this episode. Issei, he is special. It's not just twice critical. One of the 13 long longiness or some shit. Boosted weapons. I don't really know what that really means, but it just means he's super, super special. Every 10 seconds, it's basically boost to and doubles up every time. I thought that it was going to be more like the hornier he gets, the more powerful he'd be. I, th I thought that'd be like a funny concept, but I guess just by default, every 10 seconds, you know? just ramp up i'm sure later in the game there'll be like a different mechanic because it doesn't make sense if you have to wait that long i'm sure there'll be some kind of weird like different mechanic where isa can start off at a higher point rather than have to ramp up to that point but we'll get there we saved asha asha's joined us yuma just got fucking yeeted and at the very end there we saw dio's voice actor surrounded by a bunch of beautiful demon probably not demons angels right i don't really know I, Yuma specifically mentioned two figures too, right? Like Azdaha or some- I forget their names, but I think we can kind of be excited for super powerful people and for more of hard, like, important arcs to follow up. I'm pretty excited about this, but hey, if you're still here, if you did enjoy this reaction, please like the video, check out the other playlist for even more content, and until next time, take care.